mana kani tiwa siwa ne tiwa siwa angola shirike bonye mpya kasi. Your mother-in-law directed you to the right place and she knows what I'm capable of doing. Um, but this time it will take more than one person to do it. Um, I have to recruit some of my kinsmen. And um, to convince them is exactly the same way you convinced me. <clears throat> well, it's okay. I have what it takes to handle that. That will not, I can never be a problem. I'll take care of it. Okay. Um, the only way out of all this is for you to pay Naomi's bright price in debt. Then you will have every right to bury her as your own wife. There is no point rushing to court to pay another man's bride price. It will not help you soon. And it will not make you, according to tradition, the rightful owner of the cops. After paying the bride price, we, the elders, we now do our own part. And then we will use part of the money to, to give back Angola whatever he paid on the head of Naomi. <sighs> okay. What if Naomi's father insists on not receiving the bread price from me? I know exactly what to do. But then, I will pay him a visit. Zara, <coughs> thank you so much. I appreciate it. I hold this one. I will send you my money so that I can use it to take care of your kids, man. Huh? So that they will be able to support me. Hmm? Um, I will surprise you more. Wow. Look, consider your problems solved. Okay. You don't have any problems okay. again. Thank you. This. <sighs> ah. It's a very, very shocking news. I. I can't comprehend it as well. I, I know how confused you might be right now. But Odera, I just really want you to understand me because you are a man. You know, I can never have kids again considering the ways and manner in which I made this world that I'm enjoying now. Naomi never told me she had kids for me. She never mentioned it to me. We were in love. Yes, we were really in love but we did everything in secret. This is, this is blessing to me, but I can't 
receive blood already because I Portugal will not allow anybody take away my kids from me and Dogado that I know would rather die than to have me have those children so what do you want to do now? What everyone in my shoes would do. Which is? I would do everything within my powers to claim my children. Hmm. I can see war coming, not just between you and Donat, but between you and Angola, because he won the kids too. <laughs> Portugal, <laughs> Portugal, I have money, arsenal, and men for war. Can your money and your arsenal protect you from donuts? I think this is where Ido the Shrine will come in. According to your it's high time I paid her a visit. Action is precious. Just let me know when you are ready for us to visit him. Yes, I have to consult uh, Chief Nzube and inform him of the new development. Then grease his hand like I did to us um, and get him on our side before we can think of paying a visit to Chief Mbakwe. He has to agree to allow that young man marry his daughter Nong, in debt and have him bury her wherever he wishes to bury her. Yes, yes. I'm ready any time, any day. So far my hands are receiving what I received today. <laughs> you see, anyone can have Naomi's Cops. Uh -huh. But Chief Mbakwe and that ex convict should never do anything to stop that innocent young man from uh, having his wife's cops. Impossible. And I am impossible. I say that is impossible. It cannot happen as long as we are alive and handling this case. It will never happen. That is true. I trust you, and uh, I know what you are capable of doing. Uh -uh. Look, you will hear from me hmm? whenever we are ready. Huh? I will call you. 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 God is in God is Eh? I'll be at your service anytime you need me. Th thanks for the money. <laughs> Look, <laughs> more will still come eh? if we do this right. <laughs> We're already doing it right. Yes, we're already doing it right. Look, let me tell you, Chifun Bakwe must do what we want him to do. Oh. Else he will have us to contend with. Oh. 
We are his kinsmen. And we have the right to decide who gets married to our But Manando, Manon, Otuakode, Mokwere, Mokwere, Otuakode. I will call you whenever we are ready. Oh, no problem. I am waiting for your call. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Hmm. I can see an endless wall. I can't even perceive blood. But you need to prepare yourself. Because what you seek from this shrine cannot be found. Both of you are children of Dido. And as a father, he cannot take sides when his two children are fighting. The great one. What do you suggest I do? <clears throat> it is not in my position to tell you what to do. The gods already can see how all this will eventually end. And if it is not well handled with adequate caution, not even death can stop this war. Oku ile gana dani nweri nweri hanya menege mobu dogere imobu dende ma mo kwa gbara kete de ko kwa kporo ma Ya no ku e piero bo mo gu no bo gere ndu ko bunde ma Ha so kwara mo no pa no poko guru bo titi ni etio Mo ku ye ka de bu bu mo bi ni bu ni po Me ku go no beje wo ni ti ni mo la Ya I get it I get it is all right it's okay. Chiggy. Boss. I want the parents kidnapped. Just the way they kidnapped the dead body. And until the cops is free, he will never set his eyes on his parents. The code? Of course. You know what we can do. <laughs> it's a simple job. Consider it done. Good. Let's teach that Mugu a lesson. Rubbish. Get it done. Mugu. Um, Doctor, it's Andy Santos. Please, if you need any other thing, you just let me know. Please, I want to be very sure if the kids are my biological children so that no one comes tomorrow to question their paternity. Please. Do a good job. Okay, it's, it's all right. Um, I will call you once I'm done. Um, by the way, you need to drop your sample first. So if you're leaving, the second door by your left, that's our lab. I will do just that. Thank you very much. Okay, so thank you, thank you. Okay. Um, okay, come to the office, um, collect some samples for journey test. Okay. We will pay your husband a visit tomorrow. I have recruited most of the elders who will try and convince him to accept the bribe by from Donald. But if he refuses to let that happen. I will switch over to plan B. <laughs> plan B? Which is? Just tell me. You don't need to know that yet. Just try and convince him to accept the bride price from Donald when we leave tomorrow. The elders and I cannot afford to miss the money Donald promised to give us. Well, he has no choice than to accept the bribe price. But if he refuses to collect it, I will collect it on his behalf. That sounds like a plan. Mm -hmm. We will see you tomorrow. Yes, sir.
<laughs> I will crush anything that stands in my way from killing my children. them both if the son refused to comply. Sure, boss. That boy kidnapped my parents. I gave me two days to release my wife's cause to him, otherwise he will kill my parents. That bastard killed my wife, and he still has the guts to kidnap my parents. I will teach that boy a lesson of his life. Me bear you I will really circumcise him. <laughs> Guys. Boss. Boss. We don't have to be distracted from our plans. Yes, boss. We must remain focused. Especially now that the war has taken a new dimension. So that boy. For all the best that he has cost me and my family, I will teach him this. Ma, it be you, it be area you. Guys, boss. get prepared. All right, boss. All right, boss. I have said it all, but I will say it once again. I have only one in law, and that is the only in law that I know, the one I gave my daughter's hand in marriage to. And I don't want another, not when the one I have is still alive and still interested in my daughter, even though she's dead. This is the man that will bury her in his place so that my daughter's soul will rest in peace. And my own soul will also be in peace. This Donald of a boy, I don't know him. And to tell you the truth, I don't want to know him. Hmm. Uh, Mbappe, we know him and you have to know him, especially now that your daughter is dead and must be buried accordingly. Look, look, look. What do you intend to tell your grandchildren when they grow up and start asking questions why their mother was not buried in their father's compound? Offer, why are you sounding this way? Why are you sounding like a man that is confused? My daughter's children belong to the uh, man I hand my daughter over to. It is not in our custom for another man to take another man's child. I got a person of men and a member men. But this one is different. This case is different. Eh? The Angola of a boy spent almost a decade abroad in the prison. And our daughter couldn't wait. So she legally got married in the city with another man. And they get birth. Yes, they get birth. So you have to receive the bride price from the man 
so that he can bury his wife. Or we, your kinsmen, will receive it on your behalf. That will be over my dead body. You have to kill me first. Mm. Okay. Mbakwe. <laughs> no one will kill you. And we are not going to die anytime soon. Because we don't even have shishi to bury you now. Adieu. And uh, as since be said, we may have no choice than to do the needful on your behalf. That's it. And uh, you know that you are not the only father of uh, Naomi. We are her fathers too, and we have every right to receive a bride prize on your behalf. Simple. As her kids men. Simple. As you. Yes. Uh -uh. I am waiting for that to happen. And uh, you will not wait for so long. Oh. Um, um one. <laughs> Someone dropped this in front of gates. You listen to the person? No, sir. Okay, go back to the duty post. Okay, Someone dropped this at the gate. What is this? I don't know. What? Let's give up my kids. What? What? Get the car ready. Okay, sir. I'm an Angola Sirike. Angola name is Sirike. Papa Tano Bodo Bodo Chiyaribano Angola Neme Ife Sirike Ichora Kanyi Chiwa Siwa Nye Chiwa Siwa Angola Sirike Olympia Kasi Hi baby So, um, I am your biological father The man you used to live with is your friend that I asked to take care of you because of some circumstances surrounding your mom and I and how you people came to be. I want you to relax and be comfortable. This is your home, okay? Is that why my dad haven't been with us since our mom died? Uh, yes, yes. That was why he tried to kill you people until I stepped in and stopped him and he will try to kill you people again so you should be very careful don't go anywhere close to him if he calls don't pick his call avoid him are you hearing me okay sir no okay dad i am your daddy okay dad good that's my boy <laughs> so um i'll make sure the maid prepare your room make you very comfortable Anything you want, she'll give you enough food is in this house, right? That's my boy. <laughs> mm, that is love. <laughs> I want us to have a discussion. So you are the leader of the gang that kidnapped my parents. And you are taking care of them in the hideout for your boss, Donald. You know if we continue to kidnap and kill our parents and our wives, nobody will still be alive. What will be again? You know, it's not ideal. I know you will go back to that uh, hideout. Bring my parents. 
bring them back to me. I want to see them with you. Failure to do that. You will be the only living thing in your kindred. And I mean it. I'll bring them back to you first thing tomorrow morning. Great. I can explain. Uh, please, if you listen to me, I can explain. Listen to what? Where are the kids? Okay. Uh, they are with their father. I handed over my kids to you. And you're here telling me they are with their father. Listen, I stepped out to buy something only for me to return and I couldn't find them in the house. So I saw these notes and the DNA test. Portugal took them away. You conspired with Portugal and facilitated the handing over of my kids to him. No, it's not true. Shut up. I didn't do that. Please. Do the needful. Please, please. Don, I can explain. Explain to your ancestors. Please. Dugado, the journey to your destruction just started. And I will make sure you are completely destroyed. Edido. Great Edido. I come in peace. I'm sorry. I have to do this. Dido to take what is not his. Hmm. Um, 
great one. I actually visited your, your territory, but you were not there. You invaded the shrine of the great Idido and took what is not yours with intention to hurt your friend, who is the owner. But I must warn you, like I've always done, the day you stepped into the shrine of the great Idido, together with the owner of the spot of power, wet and life, is the day you had an oath to protect one another, never to intentionally hurt each other. The pot is now in your care. It is now your responsibility to take care of and protect it like the great Dido has been doing. You will die as well. The very moment anything goes wrong with that pot, you have been born. These are the posters we made for her. Uh, I have concluded all arrangements for our burial. If we leave the mug, we'll do a brief stopover at our father's house, which is here. Um, thereafter, we'll move straight to my house to give her the final burial ceremony. It is well. I commend you for all your efforts. Uh, um, I heard what uh, befell your parents. What is actually happening? Uh, that's no problem. Uh, I've done everything in you know, within my power to secure their release, and I'm sure that before the end of today, uh, they will be in my house. Yes. Mm. May our ancestors always protect you. You see. Uh, if I forget. Um, I think you'll be needing this, you know, to help yourself for ah. in preparation uh, for the burial. Uh, in case there's anything you want to buy, uh, get for yourself. Uh, and then, if there's anything that you need, please don't hesitate to let me know. No, I, I don't think I will need any other thing. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I appreciate it. Yes. Where are going to be with you? Uh, you too. Lord. Shrine to get this pot and destroy Tona. I mean, to put an end to his existence. Now I will become the good keeper of this same pot. <laughs> what a miscalculated move did I make! I will have to guide this pot to keep it safe, else I will die. Man, I've just added up extra burden into the existing war that I'm already in. Hey, Portugal, Iliense, Libuon Weginansi, Chai.
Shane or Wiliana. So I'll put ten thousand and I wire in a man again. Because next time you point your gun at me, you won't be safe. You might peg it, cag and cag it ten over ten. That bullet. Yeah. My wireless, my brother. It is not the, the cause of the juju or the price of the juju that determines its potency. Listen, my boy. I am trying everything possible to make sure our ways do not cross. But you are busy parambulating. You are running to the village to go and uh, spread money, throw money up and down to the families of my ex wife and their uh, relatives. That's it. Oh, oh your ex wife. I can see you are just coming from your ex wife's house. Where you go around every day causing nuisance. Then jumping around every AK market in the name of preparing for burial. Huh? Anyway, I just want to let you know that I've already designed the posters. And by the time you get to the house, you see the poster. Put the date. And I'm inviting you and your cohort, especially Portugal. That is if you're still alive to make it. And get ready to dig your grave. At the grave of every other person that comes there. I know they call you Angola. So you are used to antelope. That's why you're jumping around and I'm watching the sir. But mind you, if you try it next time, maybe go cool. That is why they call me Angola. If you don't know, know this. I will circumcise you. Maybe I will go cool. Uh, by the way, thank you for taking care of my mother. In fact, my parents, two of them, my mom and my dad. They started their regards. Guys, what's going on? It's in cost issue, answer that. It has not been taken in cost issue. Is morning. the parents no longer there? That's the only collateral we have. Yeah. What are you guys doing? Get in the car. You know what? If it's the kids, I'm going to send them back to you. My houses, if you want them, I'll give them all to you. What do you want? Just name it. And I, Portugal, will give everything back to you. Don't just destroy the pot that will end up destroying us. Shut up. Destroying the pot will never destroy us. And I will destroy you. Only you. Smile, don't laugh. Nothing will affect me from destroying Lugado. these walls. Look at you, please. Because we are no longer bonded together. Look at you, please. Remember, we are friends. We have come a long way. For decades, we have been friends together. We, we tore, we suffer, we did everything together. <laughs> please don't destroy me. So, because you know. You know, we are friends. But you went ahead to kidnap my children. I claim they are yours. Huh? Have you them. will never know peace once I'm alive. Have the children. Have them. I give them back to you. Please. <laughs> Shut up. I can still have them once you're dead. You don't need to give them back to me. Because you're going to die. Please. Dogado. We are friends, who? It's me, Opa Tuga. Do you think you're the only one that goes to Dodo Shrine to steal a pot? A pot of life? No way. <laughs> You're going to learn the hard way. No. Mother, you better go go. <laughs> please, please, look at it. Don't do this. Because you know. Ah! Ah! Look at it. Yo 
Just so want to burn Make a money in bang Because the money keep them up Yeah You are the money You do the cash They go to the poor Without the money My brother The money to run to Live to run to You are the money You do the cash They go to the poor 